Good day, everyone. Are you ready to learn English? If you're ready, turn to page three. Today, you're going to learn about a blurb. What is a blurb? A blurb is a short description of a book. You're going to learn about two blurbs today. Before that, let's take a look at the vocabulary. There are 12 words here. The blue color and the pink color. Let's read together. Number one. Genius. Two. Blurb. Three. Appreciate. Four. Ferocious. Five. Develop. Six. Talent. Value. Cruel. Synopsis. Grow. Clever. Skill. Now, I want you to copy this in your exercise book. Match the words with the same meaning. Okay? And let's check the answer. Okay, number one, genius means clever. Number two, blur means synopsis. Number three, appreciate means value. Number four, ferocious means cruel. And number five, develop means grow. Number six, talent means skill. And this is your first blurb about Matilda. Listen carefully. I will read this now. Matilda is a genius. She is not only a bookworm, but a math wizard too. Unfortunately, her parents do not appreciate her. When Matilda starts school at Cruncho Hall Primary School, which is run by the strict Miss Trunchbull, a big-sized and ferocious woman, she develops more unbelievable talents. Below the blurb, you will find four statements or four sentences. You're gonna write or state true or false. The first statement, Matilda is good in mathematics. Yes, it's on the second line. Math wizard means genius. So the answer is true. The second sentence, she studies at Concha Hall Primary School. And the answer is true as well. It's on the second paragraph, line number one. The answer is true. Number three, her parents are proud of her talents. And the answer, her parents do not appreciate her. So the answer is false. Number four, Miss Trunchbull is Matilda's class teacher. Run by the street Miss Trunchbull. The answer is false. Because normally a principal or headmistress won't be a class teacher. All right. Now let's take a look at the second blurb about Harry Potter. These are the words that appear in the blurb. Miserable, mysterious, encounter. Miserable means sad, mysterious means strange, encounter means meeting. Alright, copy this in your exercise book. Now listen to the second blurb about Harry Potter. I'll read this now. You can read together. Harry Potter lives a miserable life with the Dursley, his cruel aunt, uncle, and their son Dudley. He has no friends or any celebrations for his birthday. He has never played a sport too. A messenger brings him a mysterious letter. It is an invitation to a wonderful place he had never dreamt of. There he finds friends, sports, and magic. Something great is awaiting him. If Harry can survive the encounter. Below there, you'll find four questions. Answer the questions. Copy this in your exercise book. Let's do it. Question number one. Which word tells that Harry Potter lives a sad life? The word can be found in the first line there. A miserable life. So, the word that tells Harry Potter lives a sad life is miserable. Alright, let's take a look at the second question. Who is Dudley to Harry Potter? Look at uncle and the son Dudley. So if his uncle is Dudley, the son is Dudley, that means Dudley is Harry Potter's cousin. 
So you will answer Dudley is Harry Potter's cousin. All right. Let's take a look at question number three. How did Harry Potter receive the mysterious letter? Yeah, there on the second paragraph, the first line, a messenger brings him a mysterious letter. Notice that the word did is used when asking question using did. The answer must be in past tense. A messenger brought him the mysterious letter. Notice the did in the question, did, in the past tense. So the verb must be in the past tense, brought. Cannot be bring. All right, let's take a look at question number four. This is um, not in the blurb. You have to watch a movie first. Harry Potter went to a beautiful place. Describe it using your imagination. This is my own personal opinion. You can write your own after watching the movie. Harry met new friends and saw plenty of magical things and creatures such as sorting hat, magical cloak, giants and movable staircases in the Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. He also learned flying using a broomstick and played a team game called Quidditch, which he wrote the broomstick. Now, let's watch the movie. I'll play the movie. Okay, and then you 